I haven't done a celebrity dusty dad video in a while. So it's time that I rectify that because there are three men that need to be in this one video. Been lots of been lots of news over the last week. But this man, David Grohl, he has been trending. He is the lead singer from the Foo Fighters for some of us that didn't know. I've got another confession to make. He took to his Instagram page to say, I've recently become the father of a new baby daughter born outside of my marriage. I plan to be a loving and supportive parent to her. I love my wife and my children. I am doing everything I can to regain their trust and earn their forgiveness. We're grateful for your consideration towards all the children involved as we move forward. So he says right here, I'm doing everything I can to regain their trust and earn their forgiveness. Okay, so this was a couple of days ago. And then the headlines from today says, then the headlines from People Magazine, David Grohl retained a divorce lawyer before revealing he welcomed a child outside of his marriage. So, <laughs> so he's doing everything to regain their trust, but also just in case, let me get this divorce lawyer on speed dial. Here he is with his wife, Jordan Bloom. He's been married for 21 years. I will say this, the people of the Twitter are not taking this well. Foo Fighter fans are not taking this well. This person says, as a longtime Foo Fighters fan, I'm going to need three to five business days to recover from this Dave Grohl being a cheater news. Y'all, ever since I learned that Martin Luther King cheated on his wife and was really chasing, um, chasing a lot of women, I, I don't put it past anybody to be a cheater. That I mean, anybody could be a cheater. Harry says, Dave Grohl's confession will forever taint rock stars' 70-year reputation of being pillars of monogamy and marital fortitude. I love the sarcasm of that because who doesn't look to rockers and say, man, that is a real pillar of integrity. Okay, so that same lady from before says, Dave Grohl, the nicest guy in rock, was so nice to publicly announce that he will be supporting the baby girl he had at 55 with a woman that's not his wife and is the reason she nor his existing three daughters trust him anymore. Now, and then she gives us these memes. And this one at the bottom says, me at the self-deletion store. And that is very dramatic. Hannah says, why do I feel personally betrayed by Dave Grohl? Um, and then the person at the bottom, with the revelation that Dave Grohl has fallen, it's finally time to admit it is all men. Like I said, like I said, these people are not taking it well. This person, Yova, says, finding out Dave Grohl cheated on his wife and had a baby and then uses this meme. And then the person at the bottom says, Dave Grohl, not only cheating on his wife, but literally impregnating another woman like at your old as first of all, you ain't got a vasectomy yet. And second, how the F your wife still with your sorry butt at this point? Embarrassing isn't even the word. Y'all, y'all better stop elevating these people and recognize that any of these people will cheat. Like stop having them on a pedestal. Please stop. Now let's go to Jeezy and Jeannie. And keep in mind that these are supposedly the most involved fathers or whatnot. And it's always just been black women that have been the problem. And she got her, she got her a special one, you know, a unicorn. But it says Jeezy's ex-wife, Jeannie Ma, claims rapper isn't giving up the half a million dollars for their child, cars, and more in divorce settlement. Now, this did happen last week. It says, after finalizing their divorce three months ago, Jeezy and his ex-wife, Jeannie Mai, are back in court. This time, Jeannie has alleged that Jeezy has not fulfilled his financial obligations as stipulated in their divorce settlement. According to a TMZ report published on Thursday, September 5th, Jeezy's ex-wife, Jeannie Mai, is accusing him of failing to provide the financial support for their child and more. In court documents obtained by the media website, Jeannie alleged that the Atlanta has not paid the $4,000 for daycare costs and school tuition for their two-year-old daughter. Now, that preference to single mom pipeline is a real thing that Cynthia G was talking about. Furthermore, the television personality alleged that Jeezy has failed to deposit at least $500,000 into an interest-bearing account for their child, transfer the titles of two cars, and cover four months' worth of her rent. According to Jeannie, she claimed 
um, her, that her divorce settlement stipulated that she will receive the 2021 Range Rover and a 2022 Ford Bronco after their divorce. However, she alleged that Jeezy has not yet transferred the titles of these vehicles to her, which has prevented her from insuring them and delayed her ability to have the Bronco transported from Atlanta from Atlanta to LA. Jeannie also needs over $92,000 to cover nearly four months of rent payments. I will like to highlight for the fact that this there's no black women involved in this story, considering they are always saying that black women are asking for too much and are gold diggers, but there are in fact no black women in this story at all. Now I'm going from Jeezy to Tyrese. Now Jeezy better get it together because Tyrese is already showing what could happen because he has already been arrested and released for a lack of payment of child support. So it could be in his future to get the same kind of treatment if he doesn't actually pay what's in the court order. These people do not understand that a court order is not something that you play with. It's not negotiable. <laughs> they really need to get their lives together and just pay it because those fees and fines are real things. All right, so Tyrese arrested for refusing to pay the $10,000 a month in child support. So this is the TMZ article, Tyrese Gibson child support case released after contempt charge. All right, so he was released from custody Monday after his attorney, Tanya Mitchell Graham, filed an appeal of the judge's ruling according to law enforcement sources. We're told the appeal means Tyrese did not have to pay the $73,000 before he was released. That does not mean he no longer owes the back child support. It's just delayed for now. It's the same legal maneuver Tyrese and his attorney made last year when the judge ordered him to pay up the child support. Tyrese um, is in custody for a pay. Okay, well, he's out now, so he's not in custody anymore. The singer, actor, and dad to five-year-old Soraya with ex-wife Samantha Lee was in Fulton County Court Monday morning to face the judge in an ongoing child support battle, and the hearing did not go well. Judge Kevin Farmer was clearly fed up with Tyrese's refusal to pay the $10,000 a month. Farmer ordered him to start paying way back in April 2023. So today he held Tyrese in contempt of court. The bailiff put, put him in handcuffs and marched him out of the courtroom. Now, Judge Farmer did say Tyrese can square things up and avoid jail if he coughs up the $73,000, which includes $7,500 for Samantha's attorney fees. Looks like Tyrese saw this arrest coming um, and he posted something to Instagram and I didn't feel like listening to him. He does way too much on Instagram. But the thing is, so on top of paying his monthly fee, he is paying this attorney good money and I'm sure she I'm sure she likes this ongoing stuff because she has payments that will continue to come. It only makes sense for him to just pay these fees because without just paying his child support, then that means that I mean, if he just were to pay, that means he would avoid these fines and fees and what he has to pay his lawyer. But instead of doing that, instead of just making it easy on himself, he's doing it the hard way. Why these people are such knuckleheads is beyond me. Why can't they, like in the case of Dave, he should have had a, a vasectomy by this point. If you're going to cheat, at least use a condom. What is wrong with these people? What is wrong with these people? And then both Tyrese and Jeezy were married to these women. You would think that they would get a different person, but no, they're getting the same BM. They're literally, because why are they avoiding paying child support. I thought only black women were the ones that were gold diggers. Apparently not. These people just simply do not feel that they have to support their children, except for David Grohl. He says he's going to support his out of wet, out of marriage baby, his affair baby. All right, y'all. Celebrity Dusty Dad segment. Let me know what you think of all of these. Did you see it coming? Do you think these people are going to pay up? Do you think that David Grohl and his wife Jordan are going to get a divorce? Weigh in now. Like, comment, and share.